Hello and welcome to our YouTube channel, Global Solutions. In this channel, we focus on giving definite information regarding various topics which covers computer-related stuff for kids from class 1 to 9, programming languages like C, Java, Python, C++, and many more coming up in future. Objective question and answers, moral stories, some cultural religious facts which include motivational stuff around like Osho, Quotes, Daily, daily Positive Thoughts, Kabir Dohe and Mata Rani Navratri Stories. We really hope you check our playlist section for all these things. We have compiled the playlist section very well. Today's topic of video is difference between RAM and ROM. RAM versus RO. Although RAM and ROM both are internal memories of computer, they are different from each other in terms of their uses, storage capacity, physical size, and more. Let us see how they differ from each other. What is RAM? RAM RAM stands for Random Access Memory. It is internal memory of CPU in the form of hardware device located on the motherboard of computer. It is designed to store data, programs, and results of program when a computer is switched on. It is the read and write memory of computer as we can write information to it as well as read from it. Furthermore, RAM RAM is a volatile memory as it can. It store data and instructions permanently. For example, when we switch on a computer, the instructions from the hard disk are stored in the RAM. These instructions include the operating system and, and other programs which are needed to run a computer. CPU uses these instructions to perform the tasks required to run the computer. This data is retained by the, by the RAM as long as the computer is on. The moment you shut it down, the RAM loses the data. The reason for transferring, transferring the data to the RAM is that it is easy and fast to read data from RAM as compared to reading it from hard drive. ROM ROM stands for read-only memory. It is non-volatile memory that stores information permanently even when the, when the system, when the power is turned off. Like RAM, it is also primary memory of computer. It is called read-only memory as the program and data stored in it can be read but cannot be written on it. At the time of manufacturing, the manufacturer fills ROM with the programs that can be altered, that can be altered later. So can, you cannot e-program, rewrite or erase its data after it is manufactured. However, in some type of ROM, you can modify the stored data. Some common examples of ROM include cartridges used in video game console, the data stored permanently of personal computers and other electronic devices like smartphones, tablets, TV, AC, etc. Some of the key differences between RAM and ROM are as follows. RAM, it is a temporary memory of computer, ROM. It is a permanent memory of computer, RAM. It is read-write memory. The data can be written and read. ROM. It is a read-only memory. The data can only be read. RAM. It is a volatile memory as it, as it temporarily stores the file as long as the computer is on and working. ROM. ROM is a non-volatile memory as it permanently stores the files even when the power is turned off, such as game cartridge and BIOS program stored in the memory of computer. RAM, the storage capacity ranges from 1 to 256 MB GB. ROM, the storage capacity ranges from 4 to 8 MB. RAM, it is large in size than ROM. It com comes in two different sizes for use in desktop computers and laptops. A desktop RAM is around 5.5 inch in length and 1 inch in width, whereas laptop RAM is around half the length of desktop RAM. ROM 
Its size ranges from less than less than an inch in length to multiple inches in length and width based on their use. It has less capacity than RAM. RAM. Data stored in RAM can be retrieved and altered. ROM. We can only read the data stored in the ROM. It cannot be altered. RAM. RAM is faster, faster than ROM as it is high speed memory. ROM. ROM is slower, slower than RAM. The data stored in the RAM is used by the CPU in real time to run the computer. The data stored in the ROM is used by the CPU when only when it is transferred to ROM. It temporarily stores the files and data that the, that the CPU needs to process the current instruction or work. It stores the BIOS program on the motherboard of computer which is needed to bootstrap the computer. Example, it is used as CPU cache primary memory in a computer. Examples, it is used as a firmware by microcontrollers. The stored data is easy to assess. The ROM, RAM, the stored data is not easy to assess, it is in ROM. It is costlier than ROM. It is cheaper than RAM. Types, DRAM, SRAM, dynamic, dynamic random access memory and static random access memory. And the ROM types is PROM, programmable read-only memory, EPROM, erasable programming or read-only memory, EEPROM, PROM, uh, electrically erasable pro programming ROM, mask ROM. Wow. Very nice. You have learned about the difference between RAM and the ROM in this video. And it's a very nice comparison by Java, Java T point. Thank you so much, guys. We have compiled this video on the basis of our knowledge, which we get after studying and analyzing the stuff from the various topics. We really hope that you receive knowledge. And uh, in the end, last but not the least, please do like, comment, support, and subscribe to our YouTube channel, that is Rubel Solutions. We will be posting more and more in the newer future. Love, love. Stay connected. Have a nice day. Please be kind and be safe, everyone. Thank you, thank you, thank you.